Boom Hauer 69 here, and I'm going to show a little lighter here. This LC Fun Lighter, this is, um, it says here, LC Fun Lighter, Lighter, Classical, Fashionable. What this lighter is marketed towards is for people who do hiking and camping. And what makes this lighter stand out from other lighters is, this is one of those cheap electric plasma lighters that you see a lot on Amazon. Amazon and they come in all different shapes sizes and colors That's what this is. It's one of those plasma double arc lighters Here's what it is and this one had over 4,262 reviews and four and a half stars reviews not quite full five stars but four and a half stars so total full four full stars and then a half a star on Amazon and I've seen videos about this and I thought it would be neat to get one of these for myself for my hiking pack and and to kind of mess around with I guess and seen a lot of videos about it and and people had talked about how good these are and I'm reading any Amazon reviews I thought it would be kind of neat thing to have I wasn't gonna actually do a video about this product but then I got thinking yeah I might as well so here it is this is what the lighter looks like itself in the case. It claims to be windproof and waterproof. But here's the actual lighter itself. But it comes with an emergency whistle and lantern. Here's the actual whistle itself. Now this emer this whistle is since it's geared towards hiking and camping. You would use this whistle to if you got lost and you need to sing signal for help and get somebody's attention you would obviously blow on this whistle to signal for help but there's a little lantern and it also has a little thingy that you can you can also unplug the rope where you can leave this attached to the lighter and simply unplug it from the lantern itself if you don't want to have the lantern on or you're trying to you know use this to start your campfire and here's the little small USB cord. It's not a very long USB cord, quite short, but there's a little charging USB cable. Now here's the instructions and information on it. But well, there's what the information on how to use the lighter. And then here's the back side with all the kind of electrical information about it, and I'll read that. It says here, product type is double arc lighter, um, rated voltage as 3.7V, and charge voltage is DC 5.0, and then 0.25V. Charge time is 1.5 hours, so an hour and a half to charge this one instead. And battery capacity is 200, 220 m. A H and battery life is 300 charges so the battery life is once you charge this 300 times then the battery's junk and you know, throw it out you recycle it and then it's done for so it's got so you can charge it up to 300 times and and you'll be good but after 300 times then it's junk and won't be have to be recycled but there is what it looks like again there's where you would put your um, lantern if you're just going to attach the lantern necklace to it. But to simply open it, this little tab right here, you fold that down. And then you hit this button and it reveals the actual lighter itself. One thing you can do is you can take this lighter out of the case. So that way when this part, the battery completely dies on it and it's junk, you can recycle this and then you have a a little case to either turn this into a, like a little mini fire starter kit or maybe put uh, if you can I don't know maybe a Zippo lighter in there if one would fit or if you can get another one of these a replacement arc lighter then you can simply reuse it again and they say it's windproof and waterproof but there's the um rubber seals so to protect the lighter but one that they mean by waterproof is one it's fully closed like this and you say you're walking along you accidentally drop it in a puddle of water or in a creek or wherever in some water you can hurry up pick it up shake it off wipe it off and use it but I'll show you it here 
And to turn it on, here's the USB port where you plug in your USB cord. Now here's the button to turn it on and off. And to turn it on, you just simply hold this button in. And then you let off the button to shut it off. But that's how I do it. And that's why they call it a double arc lighter because it's got two little arcs. I don't know if you can see that very good. But, but there's what it looks like on, off. And you just simply hold down the button to turn it on and off. And I'll blow on it to see if it's actually windproof. Yeah. Yeah, I would say it's pretty windproof. Yeah, I'm going to say it's pretty windproof. I notice if you don't put a good amount of pressure on the the button it will shut off so you have to be careful on that but to simulate the um waterproof to see if it's actually waterproof i got a bowl of water here and i'll just simply drop it in the water now i notice this doesn't float it instantly sinks to the bottom because of the weight but from looking at it right now i don't know if you can see it very good in the bowl here but i personally don't see any bubbles coming up so i think it's Pretty good in seal. I think those rubber gaskets are holding it up pretty good. Those rubber ring gaskets. But what you do is when you accidentally drop it in the water, you want to wipe it off with your shirt or rag before opening it. Get all the moisture and stuff off. Shake it off. Wipe it off really good. And here, I'll do it one more time show you. But yeah, it doesn't really float. But you just simply shake it off like this and then... You know, take a rag or something and wipe it off. But and then again to open this, you remove this little thing right here, this little locking tab. You move that down, press the button, and then you hit this button right here to turn it on, and it works still. But yeah, I just got this just to have an extra thing in my survival pack to start a fire. Your uh, camp fire, but yeah. And then to close it back up, you just simply go like this, and it clicks into place. And then you just push this back up to lock it down. But yeah, this is a so far messing around with it. I think it's going to be a, a nice little handy thing. It's only fifteen dollars, so it wasn't a whole lot of money. So if it, one of those things where it, I don't use it much, and it conks out on me. I I ain't out, out a whole lot, but of money, so yeah. I just got this because I plan on in the near future for my hiking pack getting a, a little solar panel, and I always saw videos about these, and I thought these were kind of neat little lighters to have to stuff. Now they market these towards um camping and hiking, you know the. As a way to start your campfire and stuff. So yeah. That's why I got it. It's just to have a nice little handy little electric lighter to throw in the pack. In case something happens to the butane lighter I have. If the butane dries up in it. And, and I can't get it to a spark or anything. I, and and I'm out of matches. Or my ferro serum rod's not working or whatever. I have another backup source. Because always good to have in your hiking camping pack. A variety of ways to start your campfire and stuff, especially if you live in a cold climate and you gotta keep warm. But yeah, that's why I got it. I hope you enjoyed this kind of short video and and learned quite a bit about this and stuff. And hope I was really good at explaining how this works. I'll do it one more time. Simply open this like that, go like this, and then press that little button. To turn it on and then when you want to turn it off you just let your finger off the button you hold down the button to turn it on and then you just want to shut it off you just let it off and then it just clicks into place like that push that up there and now it's locked and won't go anywhere but i hope you like this little short video hit that red subscribe button down below to help boom Howard 69 boom Howard 69 to grow his channel comment below your thoughts on um electric plasma arc lighters and and have you ever used this brand and and what was your thoughts on it or
comment below some other type of lighter you know about that I may not even know about and, and I'll have to check it out sometime on Amazon but or if you like this video give your comments give it a thumbs up share this video with everyone you know to help Boomhouse 69 out to grow his channel and I hope you all have a good day and thank you for watching this video